Now, I don't know how often you do this, I know I do it a lot, and that is to equate someone's identity or their, their value with the opinions they hold. You know, this idea that if someone holds a, a stupid opinion, it's easy just to write them off as being stupid. And yet something very dangerous happens when we do that. Firstly, it's too easy to just diminish someone's value entirely if they hold a view that either we don't understand or doesn't seem to stack up with what we see in reality. That also means we can't learn from that person. We can't listen to them because we no longer see them as worth listening to. But there's something else that happens that's dangerous when we equate identity with opinion. We just have to see ourselves as the sum total of our opinions. We become partisan to our views. And therefore, any attempt to change our mind, any thought that we might need to change our perspective is seen as giving up something of who we are. Now, that's, that's hard to do. That's a threatening sort of concept. And so the reality we've got to keep front of mind always, whether we're dealing with other people or thinking about our own views, is you are not the sum total of your opinions because opinions change. People's value has got to stay the same. We've got to see people as uniquely worthwhile and worth listening to and having regard for, even if we don't understand or relate to the opinions that they hold. Now, for more tips on my latest book, Mindstuck, stay tuned.